because at the time, you know, if you were a DJ, you had a head of a really macho DJ name, like, I don't know, you know, Ice or Lightning or Lionheart or whatever. And so, um, so I wanted something that was like just totally pussy. And at the same time, I was living in the East Village. And of course, I was, like I said earlier, I was involved in like women's reproductive rights stuff and that sort of thing. And Annie Sprinkle was doing her, um, uh, doing her kind of, um, you know, feminist sex show type stuff um, nearby. I forgot the name of this kind. It was like a church that was converted into a performance space on 10th, I think, 10th and 1st or something. And um, so it was, you know, in half this kind of half tribute, half also kind of parody of Annie Sprinkle and then also um, and Golden Showers and this sort of thing. And then also there was this really ridiculous... Um, uh, cake commercial on TV at the time it was like uh, Pillsbury or Betty Crocker or something like that had the, had a cake mix where that came with the frosting and these little candy sprinkles and the, and the announcer in this totally you know nerdy voice is going with sprinkles in the mix and I thought that this was like you know this like totally lame kind of like hip hop DJ shout out type of thing you know <laughs> sprinkles in the mix so <laughs> so I thought yeah okay DJ sprinkles is totally in pussy mix. and dumb and yeah so.